I think the whole world has been debating that once China is reaching almost about 20 trillion economy, some of the old methodologies of ensuring high growth rates will need to be revised and recalibrated now. We understand that China's growth rates have already come down from once upon a time being 10% to now being 5%, which means the leadership here is thinking of new strategies as to how a 20 trillion economy can still continue to grow at impressive growth rates. The focus here fundamentally is to ensure innovation-led transformation of traditional industries. In that sense, there are a lot of initiatives that China has already taken in more, more recent years. For example, the 5G internet penetration has already crossed 50% in China. Digital economy has crossed 40%. We are today talking of China being a leading player in nanotechnologies, in electric vehicles, in photovoltaic products. There is so much more focus on biomedicine and sectors like uh, you know, sort of nanotechnology and, and, and innovation-driven transformation, uh, which is leading to automation and so on. So these are focusing on efficiency and high quality production so that China's growth rates can still continue to be impressive even when it has now become about a 20 trillion economy.